Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Happy almost weekend. So it is currently Friday and it's actually a little bit earlier on Friday because I am taking the next, well, I'm taking like an early day. So I'm about to head into the city to go meet up with some girlfriends. I'm going to see Lauren and Melina, two of my closest blogging friends. I met them through social media and we became so close. So we're going to the super trendy like outdoor patio for happy hour. I'm a foodie so I'm probably gonna get something to eat especially because it's an hour drive there an hour drive back so I'm definitely gonna be doing that but I'm excited to have some girl time and then after that I'm going to be going to my boyfriend's house we'll see how much I record there because we're not doing much and then tomorrow I'm super excited because I'm gonna be hopefully finishing my DIY headboard so I'll tell you guys more about that tomorrow when I'm like in the zone doing that but anyway I just got ready and I am really excited this is dirty hair like this is I need to wash it tomorrow it may not look dirty but the like guys hack half up half down hairstyle if you guys have dirty hair because it like you can't see the oil so that's awesome but dry shampoo for the win but anyway i gotta go i'm gonna go head out probably grab a snack for the drive and talk to you guys in a bit well yeah here i can do both let me do both hello I can't see, so. hi <laughs> Good morning you guys. It is 9.50 in the morning. It is Saturday and I have literally been on my phone for like the past 30 minutes. I woke up kind of late today. I just wanted to sleep in. My boyfriend is not here. He left at like 8 or something to go golfing. So it's just me at his house. I'm going to go ahead and like get up and do my morning routine and then I don't know if I'm going to go to the gym on my way home. I can't decide because since it's like almost 10 o'clock, I need some coffee and some food, I feel like. But then I also want to go to the gym before I go home because it's like on the way. And I want to do my headboard today. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll go home and eat first and then leave again. I don't know because I feel like if I do that, I'm like not going to go to the gym. I already know it. So I don't know. I'll keep you updated. But now I'm going to go do my morning routine, I think. <laughs> What are you doing, Bubba? What are you doing? You're just lounging. Hello, you guys. Good morning. It has been... Wow, these are really dirty. It has been literally the slowest morning, and it has felt so good. So it is 11 now, and I think I'm going to head to the gym before I go home. But I think I'm just going to get like a good arm workout in or something. Oh, hopefully that's better. But yeah, I'm just going to get a good arm workout in or something. I don't know, just get my body moving because last night for dinner I didn't have like the healthiest of things so I figured I would go to the gym today and just to get the endorphins pumping because I always feel like I feel so much better throughout the day when I go to the gym. It just sets the tone for the day, I'm not kidding, but even though half the day's over, but whatever. So I'm doing that, but I'll talk to you guys um, a little bit later.
Hey guys, I wanted to show you where I'm at right now. So what you just saw me doing is I was cutting the quilt batting, I think that's what it's called. And it's a very like soft material, but it is perfect for the headboard because I had to cut these like mattress toppers and then the piece of plywood right here. But this just covers it because the next thing I'm gonna put over is the actual fabric. And I have to like staple this onto the back side of the plywood and then that like helps so like the plywood doesn't tear up the fabric on the corners so that's where i'm at right now but i feel like i don't know what the hardest part is gonna be it's been really time consuming but yeah now it's time to staple just kidding i got ahead of myself before i actually staple the quilt batting i need to figure out like where my buttons are gonna go so i'm actually gonna be like marking the foam mattress topper so i need to get a ruler and like a straight edge and see if i can figure out how mini buttons to do and where to place them. Okay, making some progress. So I had to like do little holes in here because I'm gonna have to put the fabric over it and then do like a roofing nail on it and then put the button on it. But looks like I'm not gonna have enough buttons. So I'll have to go to the store either tonight or tomorrow. But this is the progress. Oh my Lord, I don't know if this is gonna work because I just stapled the fabric and it's like really tight. Like I just had enough fabric. So, I don't know, like this fabric's very thick, so I had to like do these like dots so I know where the nail goes. But I'm gonna try to do a few and see how it looks. I hope it doesn't look too like tight, I don't know though. Hey you guys, the finished product, drum roll please, woohoo! So I will say that it's kind of uneven right now because I am not actually keeping it in this room. I just wanted to see like how it's gonna look. Um, I'm actually moving really soon so I don't wanna like nail it into the wall um, in this room. So that's why it kinda looks like that but I wanted to show you guys how it turned out, the final result. I am so, so happy with how it looked. Um, yeah, obviously it's not perfect, but you know, I like the look of it. So Angel, what do you think? So this project actually took me like more than two weeks just because the craft like cover buttons that I was using for the little buttons, I had to order more from Michaels. I like literally sold them out two different times. So I needed 46 of those and I had like 10 from the beginning. So I had to get more of those, but overall, challenging project but I think it's worth it because a headboard that the headboard that I wanted that looks like this is literally like easily a grand for a king so I'm super excited about the result and I cannot wait to hang it in the new house but thank you guys so much for watching Angel come here I hope you enjoyed this video please give it a like if you did and subscribe because I'm going to be posting more home content but that is it and I will see you guys next time